Jeff's pick to win it all, coming out of Japan. He got a 9.1 in the prelims, and he's been doing it ever since. Yuto Horigame. Angle in a weird way, and you have to carve around the ledge that's at the top of them. Yuto Horigame. All right, let's, let's watch this kid. Jeff's pick, and that's why. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yeah, a little lunch break up there. That was very. That's phenomenal. It's phenomenal. He takes a trick like that in the middle of his run, right, Chris? Blind side like that? Completely blind. It's not. Wow. It's not like he whips his head around the seat either. He does it completely blind. He has a great run right now. Interesting choice of tricks. They're all hard. Sweet! It was perfect. And oh! Hey, why, why not hit him with a 540 no grab? When you do a run like that, may as well throw on a 540. G give the crowd some aerial. <laughs> yeah, deliver some air mail to him. Look at that. Ooh! Gave a little extra credit in that. But that's nolly. That's not even fakey. That is a nolly cab. What score is he going to get for that exceptional run? That is that last trick, one. and it is nine. a nine! <laughs> Yuto Aragomi is in the nine club. Our second nine of the night here in the final, and it not Yuto's first nine of the weekend either. So what you were saying at the top of the show, Jeff, is Well, we know out. he has it, Paul. We yeah. know he has it. We know he's hungry for it. It's just, can he lay it down like the rest of these guys? They've all got it, but can they lay it down? It's got to be intimidating once that happens, though. The crowd just got word on that nine, and they are backing it. Crowds love Utah. <laughs> all right. Utah, Horigome coming in for run number two, coming off a nine on run number one. The speed that he hits that with is just impressive. He doesn't take a watch break on the back nose one, which gives him a little bit more speed going into the next trick, which is ridiculous and shouldn't actually happen in a line, but he just did it again. Yeah, he's looking very focused, isn't he? Wow. Very focused. Quick look at his time, did you see that? For like a split second, just quickly looked up in, in between tricks. I think his brain works really quick. I think that's that's one of the things that makes him so incredible at this contest. Oh, oh my goodness. That was beautiful. Perfectly timed. What an exception. And run. he hits him with the it. five. Uh, the Ollie five was way after time, but it was just for extra juice, right? I mean, the crowd the, is going nuts the, here, right? The juice is loose, indeed. So he had a nine on his first run. What's this? It's a step up, let's face it. It's a step up. He's pushing, he skated faster, did all his tricks a little bit better, and we have another nine. Another nine. 9.0 even. Wow. So Yuta Horigome was the number one qualifier, so he got to skate last. They reshuffle the order after the runs, and he's still going to get to go last because he's still on top. Wow. I mean, what an incredible run. That tray flip was perfect. So that is the leader in the Pro Open final. Yuto Horigome, after two runs, will be back with best trick right after this. I mean, these guys have had to do these tricks a bunch of times now, which makes it pretty hard. Yuto. He won the run section, straight up. Nine and a nine. Here we go. Oh, my. <laughs> OK. What's going on right now? Is, is he playing with us? I, I thought he was going to go with some sort of basic, put a score on the board, but a Nolly Cab switchback tail. That is exceptional. I'm going to throw that down and say that is just something special right there. Nolly oh. Cab to Gino. 
I, the, I don't want to be the judges, right? I don't want to judge that. That's how gnarly that was. At three in a row. That three is in insane. A row. I don't know that that's ever been done. Wow. Well, we are just absolutely just speechless up here, right? Chris, that, like, what, what just happened? History just happened. Yeah. He just got a turkey in the street week. <laughs> I feel like running all the way down there congratulating. I'm so happy for the kid. What an awesome day of skateboarding. There is everything, every try. And we've seen it. We saw it in London. We saw it in prelims. We hope to see it continue here tonight through the pylon. Coming in next from Tokyo, Japan, winner of the Pro Open in London, and he has just been on a tear, Yuto Horagome. It's funny that he's so dialed that you have to look for little things, little clues as to whether he's nervous or not. His feet shook a little bit on the Nali 5-0, and that's his version <laughs> of nerves. Whereas everybody else just bails and doesn't make their tricks. You know, we we saw a little bit of what I think was the impact of those nerves in London before he won. He he bailed a bunch of tricks when he should have been that's, making them. That's right. He gave he gave everybody a big scare. Like, wait, is he not going to put down four? And and Shane O'Neill had to step in and say, Hey, Utah, just chill out, just make your basics, and you're going to win. And that's what happened. Right, and he just crushed a run. As though it was a warm-up run. So the shaky feet had no in, no impact whatsoever. None at all. Look at this. Just a gigantic switch stance backside lip slide, which a couple years ago would have been an ender in a video part, but is now just thrown in Uto's run at SLS. Gonna shout out Ronnie Bertino, inventor of the switch back lip. Nine club right off the bat, Uto. And that's how he started in London. Remember, back-to-back -back nines in the runs? That's right, two, two nine runs, which never, ever happens. Yuto, who's in third. I don't think we're gonna see a bailout. But no. anything Yuto does will put him back in the lead with his fourth score. Oh. Hey, now. Wow. That's the trick that could just seal it for him. And that is the trick that sealed the deal in London for him. But it was on a much more mild obstacle. Yes, not a handrail as big as your living room. <laughs> Look at how he did that. One footer, which should be extra points, right? Bob Burnquist rule. <laughs> and look at how he lands it. Just, yep, that makes sense. Nine club. Nine point five. Wow. Things are heating up inside this arena like they are outside. So Yuto Horagome moving back into the lead, trying to follow up his win in London here in LA. Let's keep it going. We'll be back after this with more best trick. Yuto. I mean, current leader. What's he got for us now? Now he'll nose, now he'll crook. Incredible. That was awesome. But what do they judge it? Because it's not as good as... as All he's Andy. trying to get rid of is an 8-8. All right? Trying to get rid of an 8-8. And that, that's a low score for Yuto. Nine club. Wow, with one best trick attempt left. 
Yuto Horigome trying to follow up his win in London with another win here. That would make it two in a row. An incredible talent. So, no nerves for Yuto here tonight. You saw him shake his feet a little bit. And that's all there was. That was it. That was the only clue. <laughs> and he followed it up with nines, 9.5, 8 8.8, 8.9. The winner of the Los Angeles World Tour. Congratulations to Yuto Horigome. We'll be back with awards after this. That would be crazy. He struggled a little bit in prelims. Now it takes some pressure off himself or does he bail it and then just have to hope for the best on these next few tries because we've seen him struggle right here before. And there it is. Well, that is there the start. So we have an 8-6 and 8-8 run Before we can speculate, he had a bail on his first attempt. He did it. Attempt two, he has a make. We'll have to see where that score comes in, but he still is going to need Utah needs an 8.6 to move into third place. And then from there, it's going to get interesting. Three best trick attempts still to come. Look at his shoulders turning, but he still somehow pulled it back. Showing the control. See how the judges like that. We wait to score a nine even for Nine Yuto. club. Another nine club score here at Huntington Beach. Yuto keeping it going. Yuto three in a row. Three in a row. Yuto. Wow. What a season. That is insane. He fought he's, for it. He's got to be stoked. He was just skating around practice so mellow, too. Now it's victory lap for him. Yeah. What do you do during victory lap? Try something hard if you're Utah. Here he is, your champion here today, streaming Huntington Beach, Utah Oregon. Oh! Switch grapefruit. Switch grapefruit. Yes. Utah. That's just, why. Hey, you guys haven't seen this. Here you go. He might have should have kept that for the world championship and unveiled it there. Oh, no, that's pretty cool to see right now. True story. Just, yeah. A big deposit to all of our uh, love banks. Wow, he came through. Prelims, kind of shaky. Not sure if he was going to even make it in. And then dial. Nine point two, by the way, for the switch grapefruit. Our winner, getting a congrats from Eric Costin. Greatest of all times. Greatest of all time, go. And this is uh, a greatest of all time in training, Yuto Horigome. Three. Three in a row. <laughs> Wow, what a day of skateboarding we've seen here in Huntington Beach. We'll be back with awards after this.